Hello everyone, how's everyone doing? Hope everyone's doing well. Tonight we got a good one. Um, definitely, I was anticipating on this one. It's the Sofern IF19 uh, with the SST40 LED and 2000 lumens out of this little guy. Um, that's amazing. This thing is really tiny and pushing out that many lumens. When I was uh, looking at all the specs and everything, the first thing that came across my mind was, you know, the run time. Like, I'm not seeing good run time. They claim 45 minutes on high, which is pretty good for its size. And then uh, there's no clip, you know, there's no pocket clip for it. It's really small. And uh, there is a remedy. I'll show you guys that here in a little bit. But I got a remedy for both of them, run time and your pocket clip. Uh, yeah, let's get into this. Um, I'll show you guys where you can get it. You can get it at AliExpress, and it's twenty nine ninety nine and thirty one ninety nine. I made a mistake when I got mine. I meant to get it with the battery, uh, but I bought it without the battery. I thought I ordered the battery with it, and then I looked a little bit later on on my shipping and all that and I seen it was without the battery so thankfully I have some backup batteries um, let's see so basically uh, it's the SST40 2000 lumens TIR optics uh, let's see and they do have a 5 this is the 6000 K version they do have a 5000 K version and of course you can uh, get without and with the battery. When the 5000K version comes out, I think I am gonna have to grab that. And uh, this, the um, the UI is pretty, it's just, it's a ramped um, settings. There's no groups. They don't even have a, um, like a chart. It's just two thousand one lumen to 2000 lumens. And oh, what else was it? Um, you get a uh, low voltage protection, low battery level warning. It does have reverse polarity mode memory, so that's good for low, medium, and high. So I'm assuming. I wonder if it has a moon. It should have a moonlight, but to unlock it and lock it is four fast clicks when from off and yeah it does have a moonlight so moonlight when flashlight is off and you hold the switch to enter into moonlight and then double click is turbo that's basically it there's really nothing else on this and it is the like i said the luminous sst 40 led all right um yeah let's look let's check it out Here's the box. My box came dented, but the flashlight was perfectly fine. It was in the other corner right here. And this is a big box for this little guy. But you get your A to C cables, uh, your lanyard, which uh, if you don't, I'll show you guys how to get a clip on it basically and some more run time. But yeah, you get your spare O-rings. Looks like two O-rings and then your lanyard. And here's the light. The IF-19. I'm wondering why they didn't call it the IF-22A uh, Mini. Um, kind of surprised on that. They went to IF-19. Oops. Here it is. It's a, this thing is tiny, like if it's, you can hide it in your palm. This thing is tiny. Like it has no battery, so it's extra light. I thought I had an issue with the um, 18350. Uh, let's show you the springs. And it is not magnetic. Nice gold plated spring. Let me just go 
gold plated contacts. Looks good. All right. Um, so right here, this will not, in this setup right here, this will not accept. I thought I had a Soul Fern um, uh 18350 but i guess i got a so fern 16340 this still works though you're not going to get as much power um but it works this right here is too big it won't make contact to the the body so but thankfully i did have these i have a Another through night that's prioritary to the um to that little catapult mini, but yeah, this guy right here works. A little green light and let you know it's good. And there is your Type C. All right, we're going to put this thing on the lumen meter. We're going to come back in and see uh, it step down. It does step down after 55 Celsius. I read that in the manual. So, but we'll see how it manages its heat. Because that's, I mean, 2,000 lumens for this little guy. That's a, that's a lot to ask for. But we'll see. Let's see what we get. And this is with a battery that I got. Ah, man, I, honestly, I, I was, like I said, I... Didn't even think I had the right battery until I came across this battery. And I think this came with my Nye Walker. I'm not 100%. I think so, but I don't know. But anyways, let's see what we get. So, well, 1,600 lumens. A lot of light was escaping. Let's see if we can get a little more. 1600 lumens. Wow, that's a lot, man. The, um, I believe the Through Night, the Catapult Mini, that's only like, I have to look at it, it's like 600 lumens. And. I think I registered 500 with it. So this is like three times as bright as that. That's, man, there's a lot of power. Um, we're gonna take it outside and see what it looks like. And then we're gonna come back in and I'll do the five minute run test on this. And I'll show you guys the extra run time in the clip. So let's go outside. All right, you guys, we got that eye. F19, see what it can do. Jeez, that's a nice throw. That is literally, if you see the top of them trees, I can see it. So I think this is supposed to be like three or 480 or 90. Um, meters of throw. Maybe turn it down. Whoa, that goes all the way to the moonlight. The moonlight hits that. Nice. Let me turn it right back to turbo. That's nice. Turbo. Let's see what it looks like over here. Turn it off. Dark back there. Yeah, this is, and it's not even, it's not even that hot. So I'm wondering if this battery can keep up with this light, to be honest with you. We're going to bring it back in and run some tests. 
All right, you guys. Hey, this thing is a little beast. Um, I'm going to let you know right now, the battery I got is, it. you need a button top. I mean, it works, but I'm having a little bit of issues of it, not the connection. So you definitely want to get the Sofern button top battery unless you got some button tops. And fortunately, this one's too big. And this one works though, it's just small, it's smaller, but this works, no issues. And I'm gonna show you guys um, the runtime. We're gonna do the runtime on what you would get, cause this is a good battery. And also too, I got 1800, it was over 1800 lumens when I was messing with this earlier. So this definitely this battery is a connection problem, but uh, I'll show you guys um, what it looks like with the 31 Pro tube on it. You can use 18650, but it has to be protected because even a button top, my um, 40 or 30 Qs and the, um, the Molly cells, they're too short. So I'm gonna, we're gonna do some runtime real quick. Bring it right over here. And Set up the phone. So yeah, that battery's a little short. And um, I don't, I thought I had a uh, 18350 Sony, or Sofern, but I don't. I'm gonna see if we can get that 1800 again. You guys can see the thing. Connection. That's why we're not getting that eighteen hundred again. So yeah, fifteen. Okay, so we're gonna run it from turbo anyways. And we're gonna I, I'm really curious on the the step down on it. Make sure I got it in the middle. I got the heat gun too. So basically, 20 seconds in. I keep forgetting to get that app. I gotta get that. <laughs> um. 30 seconds in at 1260 at 97 103 is the highest I'm getting so we're at a minute basically and 1230 there it goes, starting to drop now. Hundred and fourteen is the highest. There it goes under a thousand. Hundred seventeen, the highest. The six hundred, going on two minutes. This is about what you get from through night right here, you guys. This is, I think there's a six hundred and something on the meter. I got five, five something, I believe, on that little catapult mini. I'll bring you guys in at uh, three minutes. We'll see what it says. That's 602 and it's holding 601, 602. So I'll bring you guys back in. Oops, I'm about to push the wrong button. At three minutes. So three minutes, we're at 589. I'll bring you guys back in at four. All right, four minutes at 571. I'll bring you back in at five. 
I just started dropping. We're at five minutes. There it goes. So about 4.55, you guys, it started doing that. So 363. And the highest heat I got was 126. We'll see what it's at now. It's still 126 is the highest. So 360. We'll let it run to um, six minutes and I'll bring you guys back. All right, we're at six minutes, you guys. 361, that's... Um, not that bad it's warm but I can hold it oh it should be that's not that bad 357 so yeah all right let's go we're gonna um, bring you over here and like I said you guys too this battery is not the right battery you need a button top in this And now I'm going to show you this is the SC31 Pro. And we're going to use you have like I said you can see the length on these. So you're going to need a protected cell. The Sofern won't work. The Molly cell won't work. And the Samsung and any other one. I think these barely work. But I haven't had no issue with connection though. So that's the good thing. See, there goes the green light. She's ready. Look at that. This is for extra run time. And you got your pocket clip now. I don't really, I'm not a fan of these pocket clips, but they're sturdy, so, and everything works. And a good thing about this, too, um, this got springs on both sides, so I don't have that connection problem. There you go. <laughs> That's cool. You got the 18350. Or the, yeah, 18350. <laughs> oh, man, I got all these numbers in my head, you guys. But, yeah, so that's the soul for an 18350 with the i19 tube and vice versa. Now this is a... Uh, Oh, this ain't the magnetic one. I do have a magnetic tail cap. You can even, like I said, add the magnetic tail cap. But this is pretty slick right here. Definitely. And um, I'm going to put it back together. Just so we can uh, compare them to the... This big brother. See, a word, I got a good connection on that one, but if you shake it, it'll lose its connection. And here's its um, bigger brother. So, trip, man, this little guy can. It, actually, I did get 1,800 lumens out of the out of that out of the cell that's in it right now. It was like 18 something. But that was fully freshly charged, so it's probably, you know. But yeah, that's uh That's his little brother, you guys. It's, honestly, I'm going to rock it with this tube, to be honest with you. Um, I'm using it. It works. I tried the T. The It works, but it's really... Um, not uh you can when you click it on you still have to hit the side switch to turn it on but then you can use the tail switch to turn it off but it won't come back on if you click it and click it again it um 
you have to hit the tail switch like this. I can just hit that and it come on. It won't do it with the with the um, i19. But yeah, just wanted to share that with you guys. I appreciate everybody for tuning in. God bless, and I'll see you on the next one.